Good day, grade 12 learners, and welcome to today's video in which we are going to be looking at some more formulas. Particularly, we're looking at mode, median, inter, INT, and trunk. Okay, so let's go and have a look at each one of these and what it actually does. So mode or equals mode. What does it do? Well, it reminds us here that it helps us to find the most frequently occurring value in a range. Okay, so I go equals mode. I'm going to open my bracket and you can see what it's telling me over there. So I'm going to highlight my range over here. Close my bracket, hit enter, and it's telling me that the most common one or the most frequently occurring value in a range is 25. All right, let's move over to median. So what does median do? Well, median gives us the middle value in a series of sorted numbers in a range. Okay, so let's go equals median. All right, so equals median. And then we're going to open our bracket and we're going to highlight our range again. Close our bracket, hit enter. It tells us now that the middle value here is 36.5 remember it's looking at the entire range and finding what the middle value should be let me go to int now what does that do it rounds the number down on to the nearest whole number so let's go equals int we open up our bracket and i'm just going to use it for that particular number over there close my bracket hit enter and you can see it rounds it down let's see do it again equals int open my bracket i'm going to choose uh, this number over here close my bracket hit enter and there you can see down to 35. now even if i use open my bracket even if i use 68.8 .8, you can see it's going to take it down to 68. so that's what int does so guys uh, i hope you are grasping this at this point then we've got trunk and what does this do it removes the decimal part of the number to n number of places now n can stand for any number of places trunk remember this does not round the decimal places up or down so i'm going to remove those numbers over there and we're going to pop in a few decimal numbers okay so they are popped in a number 23.553 and i'm going to use trunk you can see we have two arguments that we can put in okay the first one is to specify what we want to truncate so i'm just going to click on that and if i just leave it as is because the second part of this is optional if i just close that and i hit enter you can see it'll automatically or by default take it down to zero so it removes everything after the decimal however if i Use the same option and I now say man I want to truncate it to two decimal places then when I hit enter you can see it's taken down to two or if I say I want to truncate that down to one decimal place that's what will happen so guys this is what trunk does so I hope this helps you understand um, what mode does to give us the most frequently occurring value in a range median giving us the middle value in a series of sorted numbers int or int rounds a number down to the nearest whole number and then trunk um, is where we are able to truncate our number you know according to a certain number of decimal places whatever they are asking you in the question paper right hope this helps